back to Garage Games. Uh, we've got a friendly little rematch <laughs> with different armies. <laughs> um, again, 1750 points. We're just playing Chapter Approved, Dominate and Destroy. Uh, I've got the Thousand Suns this time up against, um, what's, well, they're Blood Angels, but Successor? Yeah, Blood Angels, Grieving Angels. Grieving Angels, so. Yeah, I did start calling them, calling them the Weeping Angels, but it was just too Doctor Who. <laughs> <laughs> um, We'll see if they grieve. <laughs> <laughs> well, I grieve with when Magnus dies. <laughs> he's one of the good guys, yeah. So, uh, <laughs> Magnus did nothing wrong. Uh, he tried his best. <laughs> um, <clears throat> yeah, we haven't set up the table or anything yet. We're about to work all that out, and um, we'll just run through some army lists and then on to deployment. For the Thousand Sons, we have Magnus the Red. We have a Demon Prince with Malefic Talons and the Dark Matter Crystal. We have Araman on a Disc of Zinch, and we have an Exalted Sorcerer with the Helm of the Third Eye. We have a unit of Rubric Marines with the Soul Reaper Cannon. We have a unit of 15 Cultists with a Flamer. A unit of 30 Zangors with a Brayhorn. A Zangor Shaman. And a unit of Scarab Occult Terminators with a Soul Reaper Cannon and a Hellfire Missile Rack. For the Blood Angels, we have a Captain with the Warlord trait Artisan of War. And an Inferno Pistol, a Relic Blade, and the Veritas Vitae. We have a Chaplain with a Hand Flamer, and we have a Sanguinary Priest with a Bolt Pistol and Power Sword. In the Troop Slot, we have a Tactical Squad with a Grab Cannon, a Combi Grav and Melter Bombs, another Tactical Squad with a Multi Melter and an Inferno Pistol. We have a Scout Squad with Combat Knives and a Scout Squad with Bolt Guns. We have two units of five Death Company with a Power Axe and a Thunder Hammer in each, two lots of three Inceptors with Assault Bolters, a Devastator Squad with three Multi Melters, a Heavy Bolter and a Combi Melter, a Drop Pod and a Rhino, and a Storm Raven Gunship with two Storm Strike Missile Launchers, a Twin Assault Cannon, a Typhoon Missile Launcher and two Hurricane Bolters. Alright, we've just finished deployment. Um, we rolled up the Frontline Assault. Um, so you'd think we'd probably be trying to push in the middle here and, you know, get, get in the thick of it, but... We're both on the corners. Um, so objectives are uh, one hidden here. Uh, there's a few in the open. So two of them are sort of right in the middle of the battlefield. One is hidden there and there's another one down here. So I've got a unit of cultists sitting over here. Just I wonder what they're up to. Um, and everything else is here. Except for the Zangors and Terminators in Deep Strike. Um... In terms of spells, uh, I think I've already run through all that, so we'll um, take a look at this side. And again, that's all up against the deployment zone. Um, what have you got in Deep Strike? Uh, so I've got a drop pod with a tactical squad and a devastator squad in it, mm -hmm. and I've got two inceptor squads. Uh, okay. In yep. And um, who's inside these? Uh, so in the Storm Raven is 10 Death Company and a Chaplain, mm -hmm. uh, and in here is a Tactical Squad, my Captain, and a Sanguinary Priest. Okay, very good. Um, so I think we're on to a roll-off for first turn. So if I could find a dice somewhere that would... Do you want to just roll first? Yeah, you can roll. <laughs> so I've got four. <coughs> four, all right. Uh, so yeah, let's see how we go. I'll chuck that again. I'd like the six, but... <laughs> All right, that's go. a six. Well, we're going to try and seize then. Yeah. No. No. All right. Um, we'll be back after I've made my first move. So, first turn movement. Uh, I ran the cultists over here onto that objective and out of sight from a lot of things. And everything here shuffled up a little, so the rubrics ran to get to that spot. Um, the Demon Prince and everything just moved up slightly behind them and Magnus has moved up to get range for smite and so on. So I'm going to get started into the psychic phase and I'll start with Weaver of Fates. So I need a 6 on that one and I'm going to cast it onto Magnus. This is from Aramon. Uh, I can reroll ones because of Magnus's ability. <laughs> so that, that won't go off unless I uh, command point the other one and I've got plus one to this 
It's a little early for command points, but having a three-up involved is pretty important, so I'm going to spend it. <laughs> so he's not weaving fate. <laughs> um, all right, I'm going to try Gaze of Fate from the Demon Prince now because I'd like another re-roll somewhere. So I need a six for this. Yep, so I can re-roll one more dice. Uh, and he's going to cast Diabolic Strength on himself, on the Demon Prince, uh, and that'll go off. Uh, so now I'm going to go Glamour of Zinch from Araman onto Magnus, needing a seven. Uh, <laughs> Okay, I'll use my Gaze of Fate. Alright, that's good. So he's now Neg 1 to hit. Okay, so I'm going to cast Warp Time from Magnus onto this Exalted Sorcerer. I want to get some Smite range, so uh, he needs a 6. He gets plus 2, so he's okay with that. Okay, uh, now that same Exalted Sorcerer is going to put Prescience on the Rubrics, so he needs a 7. Uh, that won't happen. Um, and now I've just got some offensive stuff, so uh, that Exalted Sorcerer is going to attempt Smite. Uh, that'll go off. So I think the closest he can see is probably the Scouts. Yeah. And I've got 24 inch Smites with 1000 Suns, so that'll take one out. Doom Bolt from Magnus, so I'm going to target the Rhino. And I need an 8 for this, since the FAQ, uh, plus 2. Uh, he can reroll 1s for himself. Uh, I don't think it mattered, he's still got the 8. So that'll hit the, um, hit the Rhino for 1. And now he um, halves his movement characteristic in the next movement phase, so okay. that's kind of handy. Um, and I'm going to... Cast a Smite from Magnus. Uh, that'll go off, so that'll do D6 Mortal Wounds, probably to the Scouts. Uh, two. Um, I don't have any shooting because it all ran, so that's the end of my turn. I, uh, I think we've got a morale check down there. Uh, yeah. no, they're fine. They're fine. So I do not get first blood, but um, I get two objectives for sitting on them. So we'll be back after the Blood Angels movement. Okay, so Blood Angels first turn movement. Um, what have we done? Okay, so these guys just advance over here. Mm -hmm. um, uh, it just moved. Um, we said the Doom Bolts, so we're going to move six. Mm -hmm. uh, and these guys advanced over here, and the Storm Raven has swung over here. Very nice. So, um... Only shooting one thing? Yeah. What's the, uh... What's the target? So, the... <laughs> <coughs> on the Storm Raven, which is the only thing that can shoot, so it's uh, Hurricane Bolters and Assault Cannon at the Cultus. Okay. Uh, and the Typhoon Missile ones are in the Storm, storm Strike Missiles at Magnus. Very good. Uh, who's first? I'll start off the Cultus. Alright. Okay, so hitting on threes. Uh, wounding on threes. Uh, so that many saves. Uh, I'll just grab them. Yeah. Sixes. <laughs> All right. So seven. Seven. Okay, I've got eight left. Okay, <laughs> and now the assault cannon. <clears throat> and wounding on twos. Mm. Killing on twos. Killing on twos, yeah. So that's all of them, I think. Um, that's eight. All right. <laughs> Say la vie, boys. <laughs> Okay, so the Typhoon Missile Launcher at Magnus. That's one hit. <coughs> so that's strength? Uh, strength eight, so that's a wound. Okay. What's the AP? Uh, minus two. Okay, four up. Uh, what's the damage? D6. I'm going to CP that one. That's <laughs> uh, four. Four, all right. <clears throat> okay, he's down to 14. Okay, and the Storm Star Missiles. Uh, one hit. Uh, one wound, uh, it's minus three. Uh, <laughs> he's not liking the saves. Flat three damage. Okay, he's taken seven, he's on 11. All right, um, is that your turn? Uh, that's my turn, and I've got two objectives, so that brings you up to three. Beauty, and first blood. All right, we'll be back after Thousand Suns turn two movement. 
and here's my second turn of movement. Um, the rubrics have just climbed up into the building, but still holding that objective. All the wizards have run up here, cast some shenanigans, and I've dropped the terminators down on that objective. Um, the Zangors are still in deep strike, so they'll turn up at a more appropriate time, maybe. Um, and I'll just move on to my psychic. Okay, psychic phase. I'm going to start with Gaze of Fate from the Demon Prince, uh, needing a six. <laughs> uh, I'm within nine of Magnus, or I'll just check that. Yep, within nine of Magnus, so um, re-roll this one. I'll do it so I can re-roll a dice. Um, now I'm going to cast Temporal Manipulation from the Exalted Sorcerer onto Magnus, needing a six. That'll go off, so he'll heal D3. One, so he's up to 12. I'm going to cast Glamour of Zinch from Araman onto Magnus, needing a seven. That'll go off, so he's need one to hit. Uh, I'll do Weaver of Fates, needing a six. Uh, he gets plus one, but I'll roll that anyway. Doesn't matter, he goes off. Um, so now he's got a three up invol. Um, I'm going to go Diabolic Strength from the Demon Prince. Uh, I won't cast that one actually, I might just smite with him. So needing a five. <laughs> Can reroll those with Magnus. So that'll go off. Uh, I think that'll hit the scouts. The scouts. So that'll take out two. Uh, I'm going to cast Smite from the Zangle Shaman. Uh, that'll go off. I'll see if I can get the big Smite. Uh, no. On the Rhino. Yeah. For three. Uh, I'm going to cast Smite from Araman. That'll go off. So Araman on the Scouts. That'll take one out. Scarab Occult uh, Terminators. I'm going to go... Zinch's Firestorm on the Flyer, needing a 7. Uh, I'm going to use my Gaze of Fate reroll for that one. Uh, that fails, so that didn't work. Um, and I'll just check the Rubric Sorcerer. And the Rubric Sorcerer is going to smite for uh, needing a 5. That'll go off, Just he only does 1. And now it's all, all Magnus. So, I'm going to start with, uh, I might even use a stratagem, I'll just check. Okay, I'm going to use the Kabbalistic Focus stratagem um, to give plus two to the next spell for Magnus. And I'm going to use his Smite. So, this will probably hit that Rhino. Uh, hitting on a, or well, going off on a five to start, but plus four. So, you can reroll the one. Uh, yeah. Yeah. I think so. He might need a 12 for his one. Okay, so that's a uh, not a mega smite, but it is a super smite. <laughs> so that'll be D6 on the Rhino for four. What's that down to now? Two. Okay, I'll, uh, I'll hit that one with a Doom Bolt then. Needing an eight. I'll get... Five plus two is seven, that won't do it unless I CP, uh, I might CP the two actually. So that will go off, the other one was a three. Uh, so I'm down to two command points now, but this will be D3 models for two. You get him. Got him. So, does it explode? <laughs> Ugh. <laughs> Mm. Yeah. Oh. I think I might just let that happen. Yeah. <laughs> Is the only one who gets his Magnus? Yeah. <laughs> so D3 mortal wounds. That's takes one. one. Okay. <laughs> and I'll roll for the guys inside. Yep. Uh, two die. Okay. Uh, and I'll try uh, Magnus's last spell of Infernal Gateway. I need an eight. So that'll go off, and that will hit this lone scout. That just so, kills him, yeah? Yeah, it'll do D3. And I'm going to use uh, another stratagem of the Great Sorcerer and have one more spell from Araman, and I'm going to cast Warp Time on Magnus. 
So I'm down to one command point and I need a five. So that'll go off. So Magnus can move again. Okay, so Magnus has just flown over there to get a piece of his quarry. Um, and I've just moved on to my shooting phase. So I'm going to split the fire with the Terminators. Uh, I'm going to fire these two rapid firing at the scouts. And I'm going to fire... Sorry, these two rapid firing at the scouts with their Inferno combis. <coughs> two Inferno combis at the flyer and the Soul Reaper and uh, Hellfire missile rack at the flyer. So... I'll start with the uh, shots at the scouts. So I'm needing threes. Not the best. Uh, I'm needing fours. So three at neg two. No, oh, so they just do. And they have a four up the scout armor. Oh, they do too. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, actually, right. I, just, I had them when they were five for some reason. I played these guys in ages. Oh, oh one guy else survived. <laughs> Heroism. <laughs> That's right. It's Captain Gregory, he's called. Captain Gregory. <laughs> <laughs> he's a legend. Yeah. Be careful. <laughs> now, he, now he's a lieutenant or something. Yeah, he's upgraded. <laughs> um, two Inferno combis at the flyer. So I need one to hit. Uh, that'll be one wound at neg two. I it. Uh, Soul Reaper cannon. So Terminators, all rubrics and Scarab Occults don't have move and shoot penalties for heavies, so... It doesn't mean a hell of a lot, but what is? Uh, one at neg three. I go three. Just one damage. And the two Hellfire missiles. Uh, one will hit. Uh, strength eight. So that'll wound at neg two. I go three. And I think that's d3 damage. Three. Okay. Um, and I'll head over here for some charges. So Magnus is just going to charge the whole lot here. Um, feel free to overwatch me. Okay, so I'll start with the um, grab cannon. Mm -hmm. uh, there's no hits. You reroll ones for a captain nearby. Oh yeah, I do too. I think there were a couple of ones in there. Maybe. <laughs> <laughs> Doesn't matter. <laughs> um, <clears throat> so then I've got the grab gun. Mm -hmm. And the combi part of it. No, uh, there's two crack grenades from one from the same priest and one from that guy. Mm -hmm. That's one hit. Doesn't wound. Uh, and then the Inferno pistol from the captain. Mm -hmm. Doesn't hit. Okay, so... He makes it. <laughs> uh, I'm just going to put him, I guess, up here. Okay. Within an inch of as many guys as he can get. Yeah. Um... All right, so then I'll just figure out how I'm going to split this up. Okay, so I'm going to put two attacks from Magnus into the Sanguinary Priest, two into the Captain, and three into the Tacticals. So starting with the Priest hitting on twos uh, and wounding on twos. Ooh. Three damage. Three damage. <clears throat> I've got one CP left. <laughs> Is it worth taking him out? Uh, I'm going to spend my last command point. Yep, I got him. Okay. Alright. Um, now two into the captain. He rerolls his own ones. And twos, so that's two wounds. Uh, one goes through. Okay, uh, three damage. And three attacks into the tacticals. Three hit. Oh. <laughs> Time to fight back. Okay, I'm going to use uh, strategy. Mm -hmm. uh, so that takes me down to seven. I'm going to see if I get a point for it. No. Let's see if I get it back. <laughs> I do. Hey. Um, and so that gives me a D an extra D3 attacks. Not bad. So an extra two. Mm. So that's a six attacks? Six attacks left. Yeah. Nice. Okay, uh, hitting on twos. Uh, threes for the neg one. Oh yeah, re-rolling the ones. So that's five hits. Mm -hmm. uh, so on Blood Angels, I get plus one. I'm strength mm -hmm. six. So you're stuck on seven. So yeah. I'm moving on fours. Okay. Uh, that's two. Okay. Two three ups. <laughs> None. So that's uh, two plus two d three damage. Has Magnus passed the save yet? I don't know. Three takes <laughs> two. So take six damage altogether. All right, he's down to five. 
Good start, Magnus. <laughs> and your um, my lone sarge. Lone sarge. Now uh, both hit. Yeah. Now uh, one wound. Okay. Three up. Hey, he's past one. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Um. So it's got one morale, yeah. Um, two morales. Two morales, yeah. So I'll start with the tactical squad. Mm -hmm. And he says, so roll that. Uh, so he's fine. Yeah, he's good. And um, the... Can't fail. Yeah, the last one. Oh, that's right. He did too. Yeah. Um, so yeah, there goes my turn. Uh, I've got two objectives. So, you know, we'll see how we go for the rest of the game. Come on, Magnus. Um, on to Blood Angels. Uh, okay, so um, the two Inceptor squads have dropped down here. Mm -hmm. uh, the Storm Raven's gone into hover mode and just moved to here. Um, my heroic captain is staying in combat with Magnus. Mm. <laughs> um, <laughs> this guy's uh, just moved up to take this objective, the scout has stayed on this objective, mm -hmm. and then the drop pod with the tactical squad and the devastator squad have um, landed. Yes. So, um, <laughs> open fire. Okay. <laughs> Uh, well, this guy's going to shoot at you. Okay. <laughs> he hits. Yeah. He what's your wounds? Yeah. Yeah. Uh, two up. He's good. Okay. So I'll start with uh, I'll do the um, uh, the storm bolter from the yep <clears throat> drop point. Uh, all hit. Uh, three wounds. Okay. All good. Okay, so then I'll do uh, this tactical squad here. Mm -hmm. So just do their bolters first. Yep. Uh, I'll it. And that's four wounds. Okay. Whew. okay. Got the uh, two ups today. That's right, and the multi melter. Doesn't it? Um, okay, so this squad here, mm -hmm. um, so I've got three multi melters. Mm -hmm. Um, and it wounds, so it's, yeah, you just your invul. Uh, five up. No, damage. Six. Got one. Um, I might take this fella. Okay, then, um, the combi melter. Mm hmm Hits. Uh, wounded. Five up. <laughs> uh, two damage. Okay, uh, I'll take this one. Okay, then heavy bolter. Yeah. Two hits, one wound, one okay. spot. This will be a two up because of their, uh, all his dust. It's good. Okay. Um, so the, I might as well just shoot the captain. So he's gonna fire his Inferno pistol at Magnus. Mm -hmm. He hits. Yep. Um, I will use a command point. Ooh, I'll see if I get the point. No. See if I do. Yes. Um, and re-roll it. It wounds. Okay. Three up. It's good. <laughs> okay, so that just, so the Inceptors. Um, so all... these are, just so people know, these are all in here, but the bases are not compatible with the terrain. <laughs> okay, so the first one's going to fire an Mm-hmm. Four? Uh, yeah, strength five. So um, seven wounds and minus one. Seven at neg one. So he's got a three up involve for being my warlord. <laughs> Doesn't matter much. So he's down to two. Okay, and the second squad's going to do exactly the same thing. I think he's got five wounds, but I'll check that. Probably not going to matter. Many. Better. So that's uh, nine. Nine. So I've got seven. Nine dice. Uh, you've got him. Okay, that Warlord. is Warlord. Goodbye, Araman. Okay. Um, Storm Raven. Storm Raven. Just, give me a second. I just need to work this out. Okay, so I'm going to stick the Hurricane Bolters into the this guy, mm -hmm. and I'm going to stick everything else into the Demon Prince. Okay. 
Um, so let's start with the Hurricane Bombs giving a little dice here. Yep. He's up as well. I am. Yeah. And re-rolling the ones, because the captain. Mm -hmm. I think the old shaman's in trouble. <laughs> Um, okay, so he needs to make um, nine saves. Nine. Conveniently, nine dice. Five ups. No, he's dead. Yes, that's <laughs> not right. You shouldn't eat the uh, Yep, so I'll start with the assault cannon. Mm -hmm. Rerolling the ones. Uh, three saves. Uh, three four ups. So it takes one. Okay, and the Typhoon missile launcher. Both hit. Both wounded. Minus two. Four up involve. He's good. And the Storm Strike missiles. And we roll the one. No. Mm. Okay. okay. Demon Prince is on uh, seven. Alright, so that's just the charge phase now. Okay. Okay. So um, my tactical, this tactical squad here is going to charge these guys. Okay. And they do. I'll do it. We've got some Overwatch. Oh yeah, you good. So uh, these are the Inferno combis. Yep. So one hit. Chuck that again. Uh, no wound. I've got the Soul Reaper. One hit. That won't wound, and the missiles. Hey, one wound, need two. Save. <laughs> so, all right. So, um, yeah, so. Tacticals into Terminators. Yeah. These are all just combat weapons? Yeah, basically, and there's okay. a chainsaw in there as well. Okay. So, and I'm wounding on threes, because I'm a blind angel. Yep. Uh, so it's four, three wounds. Three, uh, two ups. They're good. And then I'm going to my captain. Captain. Okay, so I'm going to use that stratagem again. Mm -hmm. See if I get it back. I do. Hey. All right, <laughs> I'd like one as well. <laughs> I do not get one. <laughs> okay. So, uh, how many additional attacks? It's an additional two. Two, all right. You still got the minus one hit, Dan. Yep. Yeah. Okay. Something. Uh, three wounds. Three. Three, three ups. Hey. Uh, so I'll swing back with Magnus. Yep. Okay, swinging back with Magnus. I've got six attacks on the captain. So he can reroll his ones. Okay. And twos. <laughs> three. A uh, two, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> All right, um, and I've got some uh, Terminators, so I'll figure that one out. Okay, so Terminators on tacticals. Uh, these are the two with power swords. Uh, they'll hit. No wounds. <laughs> All right. Yeah. <laughs> uh, and the leader, so he will hit with his four staff. And not wound. Hmm, okay. It's, everything's coming up thousand suns. So I think that's the end of the turn. Okay, and I get three objectives. Very nice. I've just finished my third turn of movement. Um, Magnus has stayed in combat. We actually um, worked out earlier that the stratagem used to get extra attacks couldn't have been used, so given Magnus a couple more wounds, a bit of compensation. Um, Darren Prince is headed towards the Inceptors and the Exalted Sorcerers sitting in the middle of nowhere. And I've dropped the Zangor Horde over here, so they've got that objective and they've got a nine inch charge to these Devastators, so we'll see how that one plays out. Um, and I'm just going on to my Psychic phase, so I'll start with Gaze of Fate from the Demon Prince, needing a six. That'll go off, so I can re-roll a dice. Uh, I'm gonna go Temporal Manipulation from the Exalted Sorcerer 
onto Magnus. Uh, and I need a six for that one. That'll go off. He heals three wounds. Maybe that'll be enough to get him through. We'll see. Um, I'm going to go smite from the Demon Prince on the uh, squad of Inceptors. That'll go off. So that'll do three wounds. I'm going to cast Zinch's Firestorm from this rubric sorcerer onto the tactical squad. So I need a seven for this. That'll do it. So I need nine dice. Nine dice, any sixes, mortal wounds. Oh, four. <laughs> All right. The psychic face is coming back in back in fashion. <laughs> well, in that case, I'm going to smite with the um, Scarab Occult Sorcerer and maybe take out the remnants of that squad before my shooting phase. That'd be nice. Uh, that'll go off, so that'll do one wound to the tactical squad here, so it clears the squad. And now I'm going to smite with the Exalted Sorcerer. That'll hit that lone guy if it goes off on a five. Uh, yep, super smite. He's gone. Uh, and now it's all Magnus. So I'm going to start with smite, I guess. Ah, uh, actually, no, I won't. I'm going to go Doom Bolt into the Captain. So I need an eight for this. And on his... Uh, 11 wounds, you'll get plus 2. That'll go off, so that'll do d3. One. Ooh, I'm going to use my Gaze of Fate reroll. Three wounds. So I'm going to use two command points and attack yep. now. Okay. Oh, he gets to attack before he dies? Yeah. Beautiful. I'll just see if I get one of them. I do not. See you, bye. I do. <laughs> I'm at seven now. He's, uh, <laughs> he's very, he's ever, ever useful. <laughs> there we are, all the ones. Uh, you don't have. I don't have neg one. You don't have neg one to hit. Doesn't matter now. Okay, so you've only got a four pinball as well, don't you? Yeah. Yeah. Um, so that will be um, one, and I might just re roll one of those. Okay. No. So See do I, I get the point? I don't, uh, know. don't get the point and the save. I don't get the save. So it takes uh, three damage. Three, okay. Does that put him on uh, seven? On eight. 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 All right. So he's only plus one now. Um, all right, in that case, I'm going to Infernal Gateway, needing an eight. That'll go off, uh, and that's uh, that'll go up to 12. So it's the big gateway. Uh, that'll do D6 on the fly. Three. And now, uh, smite on the flyer. Then I can re-roll my ones. That'll go off with the plus one, so d6, five. Okay, it's a much better psychic phase than I've had before. Um, I'm gonna move on to my shooting. All right, shooting phase. Uh, I'm gonna start with the Scarab Occult. So I'm rapid firing one Inferno uh, combi bolter into the lone scout that'll hit uh, that'll do one wound neck two <laughs> he's, he's gone yeah. <laughs> um, the the other inferno combi is going here and the um, soul reaper and missiles are going up into the fly so this is the inferno combi that'll hit uh, just one at neck two uh, one two. And the Soul Reaper at the Flyer. Uh, that'll hit. Oh no, two will miss. Why do they miss? Ah, uh, because Sneak one hit. No, it's not. Someone oh, mate. Ah, alright, they'll all hit then. Yeah. <laughs> uh, one wound, Sneak three. That goes through. Just one damage. Uh, and the missiles at it. Uh, they'll both hit. And one wound, Sneak two. Uh, neg two, so it's dead. All right. See if it explodes. <laughs> <laughs> Your vehicles, they're <laughs> you loading them up with fuel. <laughs> okay, so Magnus is the only one in range. Mm -hmm. So yeah, he just takes one. Okay. 
And seven. Yeah. Mm. Ten guys? Uh, eleven. Eleven. Okay. Yeah. Ooh. Okay. Okay, so now I just need to do my death company things. Mm -hmm. uh, so three. Okay. Got some um, death company on the ground now. Um, and I'm going to fire four of these rubric marines into the inceptors down there. So hitting on threes. Uh, Are they toughness five? Yep. So two at negative two. Uh, one goes through. So one, you kill the one bow on one. Okay. That's all my shooting, so I'm going to go figure out some charges. Alright, so I'm starting off with charges. Uh, the Demon Prince is going into the both Inceptor squads. That's some fine overwatch. <laughs> uh, Toughen six. Uh, so one wound. Okay, uh, needs a four up. Nope. He's down to six. And he makes it into both. Um, I'm going to go the, I'll charge Magnus into the Death Company and the Chaplain. Needing a six for the Death Company. So, crack grenade. Yep. That hits. Ooh. Wounds. Uh, four up. Hey, Magnus. Another crack grenade. No. And then the rest. Two. Two. Four pistols. Uh, three hits. Mm. No, no words. No. Okay. Uh, six inch charge. A seven will do it. So I'll bring him up there with his whole seven wounds. Uh, and these Scarab Occults are going to charge into the back of them. Mm -hmm. I know I'm giving up an objective, but uh, I might hold off on that for a sec and figure out this one. So the Zangor Horde. He's going to charge into the Devastators and the Drop Pod. Okay, so three multi melters one hit, uh, one minus four. Five up, one dead. Uh, multi melter gun, no. Um, combi bolt a part of it, no. And you're doing the Drop Pod as well, yeah? Yeah. Two hits, no wins. No. So it's nine inches to the Drop Pod from this guy, um, but because uh, we lost a casualty here. I think we worked it out. It's about an 11. So, I'm going to get lucky here. I get plus one for my bray horn. But, uh, big roll. No. <laughs> <laughs> In that case, I'm going to charge the Scarab Colts into, into that squad up there. Uh, with a nine. These That'll guys. do it. Yeah. yeah. Okay, starting with, uh, starting with Magnus into the death company. So he's got six attacks on this number of wounds. He can reroll his ones. It's all good. And twos. So these are neg four and three damage each. Uh, okay, so I'll just do um, my black, black rage thing. Uh, so one guy's dead, two guys dead, three guys dead, four guys dead, five guys dead. And six guys dead. Okay, so now uh, swinging with the Demon Prince um, into these units. So I've got seven attacks. I'm going to put two into the lone squad, or the lone guy here, and the other five into the other squad. So I'll start with the five attacks first. On twos. He can re-roll his own ones. Uh, strength seven. So two at neg two. Uh, so it's two damage pop, yeah? Yeah. And that's into this one? Yep. Yeah. And into the lone guy. Uh, he'll hit. And he'll wound once. That's fine. He's good. Not bad. Um, and now the Scarab Occult. Alright, so four power swords into the chaplain. Hitting on threes. And wounding on fours. So two wounds. Uh, one wound. And a four starve. Uh, one hit, one wound. So. Okay. So, that's the end of my charges. Okay. Okay, so I just do both together. Mm hmm. Um, 
three. Uh, one. one. Yep. Um, so, f any AP? No. no. Uh, three out. He's good. Um, so I'll do the. I might as well do the chaplain now. Mm -hmm. uh, Rerolling the one. Uh, winning on twos, which you charge me, and I'm plus one strength five. Oh, yeah. yeah. Pretty good. Uh, so that's they're all minus ones to damage pop. Okay, so three ups. Uh, one. So I'll take that guy out. Yeah. And the thunder hammer. Yep. Uh, can we roll misses? But I can't. Oh yeah, they said both ones and twos. Mm -hmm. uh, so that's a hit. Uh, and winning on twos. Yep. Four up. He's good. Okay. Uh, that's the end of my turn. So I gave up this middle uh, objective, but I've still got the one down here, and the Zangors had the one there. So. Yeah, got some kill points. Not a terrible turn. We'll uh, move on to some blood angels. Blood Angels turn three moving, I think. Yep. Okay. Uh, so I fell back with the Death Company, just mm -hmm. to make us as in combat with anyone. Mm -hmm. And these guys fell back as well. Yep. Uh, the chaplain stayed in combat, and they stayed where they were. Beauty. Yeah. So, on to shooting. Uh, sure. So I might as well <clears throat> start over here. Mm -hmm. Okay, so the, the, the sergeant's going to have to shoot at them. Mm -hmm. um, and he might as well just fire his... So I haven't got the fire range. So you might as well fire everything. So fire the melts around the bolters at them. So do the bolters. So two hits. Uh, one wound. Five up. One dead. Melter gun. Another one. Two dead. So what's uh what are the multi melters shooting at? Uh, <laughs> I don't know what? Mm. <laughs> 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 uh Magnus. I'm going to use command point and reroll one of them. See if I can get one of these finally. No. <laughs> that's... Hmm, okay. Doesn't it? Oh, so that's three hits. Um, and two wounds. Uh, two wounds. Okay. Four ups. Ooh. It'd be nice if I had a command point. Uh, so it's four damage. Okay, <clears throat> he's down to three. So he'll do his hand flamer into these guys in here. Yep. So six hits. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Four points. Okay. Uh, two ups. That'd be good. Um, and now the Inceptors. Uh, so first uh, Inceptor Sergeant is going to fire at Magnus. Yep. Ooh. Okay. Um, it's up to seven, yeah? Yeah. yeah. And the other guy will do the same thing. That's better. Uh, one wound. One. Uh, four up. He's good. He's on three wounds. <laughs> okay, and then the storm bolts are from the... Um, this thing. Mm-hmm. Uh, toughness four, yeah, so one wound. Hey, one lives. Yeah, no, so it's just the chaplain now. Yeah, okay. Okay. Uh, we're rolling the one. Um, I didn't charge this turn, did I? No. So it wasn't charged, so I'm winning on threes. So it does nothing. Mm. Okay. Uh, power, power sword. That'll hit. One wound. Four star. That'll hit. Two wounds. Neg one. Uh, one goes through. For one damage. That's not force. <laughs> okay, um, is that it? Uh, no, I'm going to spend three mile points. Yep. And fight again with the chap. Beautiful. I'll see if I get one of them. Yep. No, <laughs> that's seven, seven attempts and nothing. All hit. Okay. Uh, all wounded. Right. Uh, three ups. Yeah. Both dead. Oh, that's the spirit. <laughs> So, end of turn three, uh, you got this objective down here. Yep. Um, is that all? Uh, yeah, I think so. 
And so, yeah. okay. That's cool. And a kill. All right, on to Thousand Suns turn four. Okay, just finished my fourth turn movement. Um, the rubrics ran uh, out of the building a bit to try to get some psychic off, but they're out of range anyway, so it doesn't matter. Magnus chickened out, used his wings and flew from combat. <coughs> um, the Demon Prince is ready for, uh, ready for action, and you know we're all pumped up down this end. Uh, and the Zangor Horde has edged closer to the dev squad, so they're hungry for a bit of revenge. I'm going to get started with Psychic, so I'm going to start with Gaze of Fate from the Demon Prince, needing a six. That'll go off, so I can re-roll one. Uh, and I'm going to cast Smite from the Exalted Sorcerer. That'll go off on the uh, Death Company, Death Company. Yeah. for three. That's it. Got him. Um, and I'm going to Temporal Manipulation on Magnus, so needing a six. Every roll the one. It doesn't go off. I'm going to use my Gaze of Fate on the two. <laughs> doesn't go off. Magnus is still on three. Um, the Demon Prince is going to cast... He'll start with Smite. He's already gazed at fate, so this is his other spell. So, yeah, Smite. Uh, that'll go off on one of those yep. Inceptors uh, for one. Now Magnus, uh, he's going to cast Infernal Gateway... Needing an eight, I'll target the uh, the inceptor that's already hurt. Well, I have to. He's the closest, so uh, that'll go off. So he'll take three, and the other one will take three. Uh, and now he's going to smite, which will hit that chaplain. Uh, that will go off. Yes. So d six, two. Yeah, got him. Got him. He doesn't feel any... No, he's not uh, that company. No? Okay. He just herds them? Yeah. Okay. Uh, so I'm going to move on to charging. So if you want to overwatch, I'm going to charge everyone. Okay, so the melters will all be the same. Um, so I'll just do them together. Now one hit. That's one wound. Five up. Hey. And the uh, bolt, combi bolt thing. Uh, no wound. Okay. Um, so nine should do it. Yeah, back with the move. So yeah, just uh, moved in what I could. Um, I've only got four guys who can attack the Devastators, so here that goes. Uh, so hitting on threes. Could have been better. And Good fours. Night, oh, there's another one? Yep. Okay. Uh, doesn't matter. Uh, so five at neg one. Uh, so three dice. Okay. And I've got one, two, three guys, four guys who can attack the drop pod, so I'll do that. Okay. Uh, just two, neg one. Uh, one goes through. Okay. And I've got no idea how many wounds a drop pod has, but I think it has eight, <laughs> so I'm going to put seven there and check. Yeah. <laughs> Very good. Swinging back. Uh, two hit. Mm -hmm. uh, two win. Two dead. <laughs> Not bad. Mm. All right. Um, that will. Oh, wow, I've got a morale check here. Did I lose any to Overwatch? No, so. He lost two altogether. Yeah. And leadership seven, so. Uh, so that's another one. Yeah, another one. <laughs> Did I buy that? Yep. Okay, that's. um. That's my turn. So I've got the one here, the one here, and I'm too far away from that one. So it's just two points plus any kills. Yep. So Blood Angels. Okay, so the attack devastator sergeant has fallen back and mm -hmm. then it's just left to sh attack the drop pod with the tankers. Yep. So I've got 11 of them 
in there now, so I'll just chuck this twice, plus one more for the litre. So, chuck the other one. Nope. And five. So, there's four so far. Oh, let's get them off again. And <coughs> so that, and wounds. Uh, so another four. There's one. That's one. Four. Okay. End of your uh, is that fourth turn? It is, yeah. Okay. Pretty sure. Okay, the chase is on. Um, I've just run everyone up as far as I could to try to get those points in the late game and secure a victory. So. Uh, Magnus and everyone have all moved around, so I've maybe got these two objectives, but... Yeah, you will. Yeah, I'm going to start out with a bit of a psychic phase. And I've only got uh, the Demon Prince in range for a smite on the drop pot, so I'll go with that. That'll go off. The three. Does it explode? <laughs> 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 no. So uh, now the uh, drop pod's dead, I'm just going to charge into this Devastator. Okay, so melt again. <laughs> yep. One down. And a bolt. Equivalent. No. Right. Ooh, pretty small, so I'll just measure that one up. So yeah, we checked it. Um, because of the bray horn, it's um, four inch. Oh, the charge was four inches and that was more than enough. So I've already um, consolidated in, so I'll just resolve these attacks. So nine guys attacking. Now I'll throw this twice. And wounds. Uh, so three at Nig one. And again. Um, so six at Nig one. Got him, Sergeant. That's it. That's it. Okay. Um, so what did I get? One two, three, four objectives this turn. Yeah. And we'll work out points and things after that and wrap it all up. Okay, so um, that's that. That's that. <laughs> Another table again. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm getting them out of the way for the yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. This is um, This is revenge for beating me so, so comfortably in, in um, Black Crusade. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> um, I guess, yeah, this is Part of the issue with bringing a Primark is it's kind of a rock, paper, scissors thing. Yeah, yeah. You know? Yeah. Um, all the Primarchs are a little different, but yeah, if you know, if you know you're up against one and you bring a list that's designed for it, then it's fine. But if yeah. it's just sort of take all comers, then yeah, it kind of tips things a bit too hard one way, I think. Well, yeah, that, like I knew I was always going to, as soon as I saw Magnus was in this, I knew I was going to be up against it a bit. Yeah. Um, but, uh, you know, he was. He's certainly killable with the army, but yeah, yeah. it's just a question of actually getting. I need to be able to charge you to kill him. Yeah. And I, and I never got the charges off. Yeah. Um, maybe. You got him bloody close though, right? Yeah, I was surprised. Yeah. 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 Well, we'll see. You know, like, maybe I'll bring Dante next time and sort him out. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Have you got um, the, the Smash Captain? I refuse on principle. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Not your yeah. style. No, I don't like, yeah, anything that. I always like to build armies which I feel like would fit into the. be actually deployed in the 41st mm -hmm. Marine. And of course, you know, the Smash Captain is probably very Blood Angel y. Mm -hmm. um, I've got a Lieutenant which is actually very similar. Okay. Um, which I've played before, but it's I use him in more of a sort of a uh, deep striking kind of list because he's got an inch ready jump back and thunder hammer and all that kind of stuff. But. Mm -hmm. I really want to. Well, this was an experimental list for me, so I wanted to try. I'm trying. I'm still trying to work out how to use the Blood Angels since the Beta rules have basically nerfed Deep Strike. Yeah. Um, so, and I don't have the big Death Company squads painted up. I might do one, but it's yeah. It's we'll see. No, that's that's a future project. Then. I don't even know what good Blood Angels lists look like at the moment. I mean, I, yeah, it was obvious in eight before the. Um, the FAQ, yeah, it's, 
you know, that, that really works, especially with their plus one ability. Yeah, yeah. Um, but now it's like, what do they do? Do Blood Angels have bikes? Is uh, that a, an option? Yeah, no, they've got the both. They basically got all the same options as the Marines, standard Marines. Yeah. Um, so, you know, there are, like, a lot of people say gun lines with them, but again, I just don't, I refuse. Yeah. That's not blind. <laughs> no, <laughs> exactly. So, I don't know. I, I actually think that this is not too bad. I just want to, it's just playing around with it a bit. Like the Storm Raven always does work. Mm -hmm. I perhaps, I think about it a bit more, didn't position it quite right. Like I think I needed to kill the cultist. Mm -hmm. um, but, you know. Like maybe I could have dropped, should have dropped the death company out of them and then tried, it was about an 8 inch charge to hit Magnus at that point. Mm, and, yeah. I, and maybe I should have done that. Um, yeah. Because the, the death company will call Magnus very easily. And you had um, plenty of command points. Oh, yeah. So, exactly. An 8 inch charge is you know, pretty doable. Pretty doable. Very well. Yeah, and I had enough to do for them to attack twice in the combat round with the yeah. Rangers, And they're 30 odd attacks anyway. They would have torn me to pieces. Yeah. You know, it's, yeah. It's quite a, a few death companies. Thunderhammers is enough, really. Yeah. Attacking twice. Yeah. So do they attack twice after all combat or again after they've attacked? No, it's, it's basically the three CPs and you attack at the end of the, like the fight phase. Okay. So you do get a swing back. Yeah. Yeah. Mm, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> if you if Yeah, if you do. Yeah. <laughs> if you, you might, if you survive. <laughs> yeah. 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 Okay. But I think the other thing with Blood Angels too, it's also I always find that they actually because they're just basic marines, I could maybe take some primaris guys to yeah. make them a bit more resilient. Um, in the troop slots. You um, thought about some Reavers or something? No, because Blood Angels frown upon Reavers. Yeah? Yeah, because... Oh, it's the fly. Yeah. All right. Yeah, because they're, um, they're not honourable. Okay. So it's not an honourable way to fight. Yeah. So, of course, I'll have them, but again, it's, I'm not <laughs> puff bunny, so I, I don't stick yeah. it in. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I've got some aggressors, but I haven't had much luck with them. Yeah. 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 I've got the Dark Angels, and aggressors sound really cool because you're standing still. And you yeah, yeah. Like the ones and but you got to get them somewhere where they can hit something. Yeah. It's like, mm, I just don't know what to do. Yeah. But I guess it's actually sort of when in that game, like you basically hit my line and it, and it disintegrated. Mm. So I've got to find a way to deal with that, I think. Um, you could always take more scouts, but I don't know. Yeah, I mean, everyone says, you know, you want a little scout screen and everything, but, you know, that um, after the FAQ, that's not as important. Yeah. You're not as worried about that terminal deep strike. Yeah. Um, but, I don't know, maybe something, yeah, like an intercessor squad sitting on some objectives. They've got yeah. plenty of wounds. And yeah. They are hard, hard to take out of cover. Yeah, that's right. So, yeah. yeah. Um, we'll see. Yeah. So, yeah, first time with the Thousand Suns on the channel. Um, you know, I, I like playing them. Uh, yeah, there's a lot I could do to that list to fix things up, but whatever. Um, Psychic phase, I've got to get better at that. <laughs> yeah, your rolling was fairly atrocious. <laughs> <laughs> at the beginning, yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, but yeah. anyway, yeah. you know, all's well that ends well. I think, I'll just bring, I think I'm going to bring my fist in next time. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Give my, how, many, how many can he dispel? Two. Okay. Yeah. yeah. And, right. and cast three. Yeah, that's pretty good. But he's sort of got like five strength, ten attacks. But, you know, he's a bit of a decent combat as well. Pretty good, um, pretty good psycho. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Well, I guess the Thousand Suns, that's that's their thing, though. So, exactly, yeah. You know, if you're not doing it in the psychic phase, then you, know, you really don't have a shooting phase. Yeah. You, know, you, you get your combat phase eventually, but yeah, it's really all about psychic. Yeah, because it was really a psychic phase that did all your damage to me. That's what killed my transport for the game. Bloody oath, yeah, all that. More than wounding. Yeah, and maybe that's why I should have played the strategy that gives me a five up in bomb against your, your mortal wounds. Yeah. Yeah. How many command points? Just one. Pretty good. <coughs> yeah. I didn't steal any of your command points. Um, I think one of them was rolled off camera, but yeah, seven rolls and I didn't get one. So, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> held with the third eye and the eye was closed. <laughs> and there's the breaks. Yeah. I, I thought burning through mine early, I'll go, all right, I'll, I'll get a few back, but no. Yeah. <laughs> anyway, um, thanks for watching. You know, leave a comment, like, subscribe. Uh, keep an eye out, there's going to be more to come. So thank you.